Sparrow, I have known him since the time I went for my Y.O.'s course, the Young Officers course, Damodar. He was the chief instructor, a full colonel. Hmm? And then later on I uh, worked with him and he was Signal Brigade Commander. And we did exercises together and he was a great guy. He, you know, I, uh, I remember him even saying, uh, words to the effect when uh, an attack went in and he said, Khun ki holi ke you know, that sort of a guy. And he was sort of a guy who, uh, I don't know where was he, whether it was, the, yeah, he was commanding an armored brigade in Babina. When I, I was then the technical adjutant of the regiment, having done various courses uh, about the tanks, and I was told to go and, along with the team, to go and collect Sherman tanks because we were changing over from Churchill's to Sherman's and these guys were changing from Sherman's to St. George's. So in case of Prani tanks, they were there. So I went there to uh, select these tanks and every tank that were put forward to me, I had reject. I said, no, this is not. Which year was that, sir? 58, 59, somewhere like that, I forget. Then this chap went and reported to him that there's a young captain who has come from Bloody Sindhos who he is not very well accepting the time. So he called to the office. This captain called I said, sir, he says, who do you think you are? You know, that sort of thing. I said, no, I'm just taking a latch the regiment. How are you qualified to, not to accept these things? I said, sir, I have done these courses and I have the technical latch and I should know what I'm talking about. So he was a very nice fellow. His two sons are in the outcome, both of them.